Okay, here's the result. Um, here's the wing, um, the left and the right. Uh, there are some areas in the front leading edge that still need to be filled. Uh, I think what I'll do is um, put some tape on the leading edge and then basically flip it upside down, drill some holes on the stern edge and pour some epoxy in there. And uh, that should do the trick. I don't want to do too much because then it'll add to a lot of weight. But yeah, here's... So what I'll do is put some tape on it, put some spring clamps on it, and then flip it upside down and pour um, epoxy in. Uh, this, this is the new wing, the second wing, and uh, it looks a whole lot better, except um, the tips of my ribs are sticking out the front. Um, so what I should have done is dry fit it first, and then I would have noticed that, and then I could have basically uh, just taken a, um, a sander to the ribs and just um, skinny them up a little bit. And this gap wouldn't be here. Either that or the, the skins could have been like a half inch wider. But anyway, um, that's just the way it goes with boat building. Not everything is going to work out perfectly, but it's uh, salvageable. So anyway, there's the wing. And it is designed to hydroplane. Um, the wing has a step in it. The angle shifts somewhere in the middle. It goes from five degrees to a little bit more steep. I don't, I don't remember if it's like eight, eight degrees or what, but um, but that is the wing. Okay, here's another update of my um, my Wing Moran Light 14. I just um, assembled the front half of the boat, the uh, the hull. Um, that right there is a called a Miller dowel. Um, it comes with a drill bit that looks like that, and that's what the the Miller dowel looks like. So it's stepped and it's tapered and uh, it works really well. It's better than just uh, a dowel. Um, but that is to hold the, uh, the bow together. Um, here's a mahogany plywood. That's gonna be the bottom. Um, here's the back half of the boat. And that, that's the center board, I, or dagger board. I just uh, glued up the dagger board here trunk um, all using type on three and some bricks Let's see here and then I'm gonna have like four or at least two positions for um, for the mast step which is going to be pretty much centered on this bulkhead here I might just cut this thing in half and then put two of them in the front and two in the back um, yeah, see, I have it basically centered on that bulkhead, which is not a really good idea. But I think I can modify that. And um, anyway, that's what the assembled boat will look like. And this is what I just put together today, the front. And um, there is the wing slot for the wing, which is right here. So it's upside down, but that's where the wing is going to go. And uh, that's it for today. I'm going to I'm going to skin the bottom right now.